The Canadian Taxpayers Federation is demanding City Council scale back its pensions. The group says the plan is unfair because taxpayers put way more into politicians' plans than councillors do themselves. Jordan Canigan joins us from City Hall. And Jordan, what changes is the Federation calling for? Well, Ian, they're basically saying that they need to scale back on how much Calgarians pay into these pensions. Now, the CTF say that there's actually two separate pension plans that Calgarians pay into, and the mayor is actually the only one who qualifies for both. According to city documents, between 2007 and 2016, taxpayers put in more than $6.1 million into those pension plans. Councillors themselves have only put in $1.2 million. The CTF says it's time for all of council to step up and come up with a more fair compensation system, one that doesn't see taxpayers paying nearly five times what councillors do. Plain and simple, it's time to uh, shut down the pension party at City Hall for City Council. It's time to put councillors in a less costly type of pension plan, one that's more fair for taxpayers, especially when you consider just uh, the, the, the troubles that so many Calgary families and businesses are still going through. Now, Craig explains that uh, they haven't uh, compared it to all municipalities in Canada, but for the ones that they have, he says that the Calgary system is certainly unusual, and he says that it's uh, incumbent on this council to take a lead and try, it, try to make it more equitable between citizens and politicians alike.